Andre, thanks for spending some time with me today. I, I know California has been your home away from home, but you signed a three-year extension. What's it feel like to be have, have a long career, hopefully, with the Miami Dolphins? Uh, it's an honor. You know, um, I'm back with the team that uh, pretty much turned my career around. I guess you can say that they, they uh, gave me a shot and I made the most of it, you know. Um, I, I appreciate them for that, and I'm, I'm going to give them 110 uh, percent, like I've been doing since I stepped foot here day one. And um, if we're just getting started, so we're just getting started from here and keep going. What was the biggest difference for you last season? 49 tackles, uh, five and a half sacks, two forced fumbles. Was it the guys around you? Was it you changing your game? Was it a combination of a lot of things that led you to those numbers? Uh, I know who I am as a player at the end of the day. Um, it was, I think it was just all about opportunity. You know, uh, for me, I don't make excuses. Um, I, I started the first time in week seven. And uh, I look at things like this that I have a lot more to accomplish and a lot more to give. Um, so. For me, I just want to keep going forward and keep getting better each and every day, and that's what I'm going to continue doing. It looked like you had fun yeah. playing last year. Yeah. What was the difference for you personally uh, just going out? Was it was it different teammates? Was it a different vibe, a different defense, a, a message? What was it? That winning. Winning. Okay, winning. there you go. That changes uh, a lot. Winning is fun. You yeah. know, um, early in my career, I didn't have too many winning seasons, so for me, it was when you win, everyone's having fun. Um, there's no, no finger pointing, there's none of that. And everyone treats things like a brotherhood. And I haven't had that feeling since Clemson. So for me, it was continuously just growing that brotherhood that we have. Um, and we know we have unfinished business. We made it to the playoffs, but now we're not that team anymore. Um, where, oh, they made it to the playoffs, right. we want more. And that's what we're gonna do. Oh, by the way, congratulations on Clemson. I'm sure you let Kenyon know a little I bit mean, about that. I, I this let off you season. guys know all about it before the it happened. The Kitty Cats had a great year, yeah. man. Oh, knock it off. <laughs> knock it off. <laughs> no, that was exciting. For it sure. was an exciting game sure. because two years in a row they get back to that national yep. championship game. You talk about winning on the field. How about winning off the field? You went up to New York City for the yeah. business combine. You're big into fashion. Yeah. Uh, what was that like for you, that experience as a player, being able to get firsthand knowledge about that type of business. It was amazing, you know, I appreciate Mr. Ross for allowing us to do that um, because I know he has a very important schedule, but he, he allowed us to come up there for a week. And um, my, my passion other than football is fashion. And I know I want to be in fashion when I'm done playing, but at the same time, I didn't really know exactly what I wanted to do. And Rag and & Bone was a brand that I've been following for years. I actually wear that brand. so. For me, it was some I got to learn from a brand that I've been following, and I know exactly what I want to do now. Going into your sixth season, uh, how do you treat your body differently, or do you? You know, do you do something with your diet? Do you do something the way you your rest time yeah. is in the off season to prepare yourself to be ready to play 16 games? Um, I've been training like a maniac since I've been in the league. You know. Uh, been on a strict diet for about five years now, and that's not going to stop, but I do know the demand on my body is going to be higher now um, going into my sixth season. So I treat my body just like as a machine, uh, feed it right, get it the right amount of rest. And if you want to be successful in this league, you have to do that. You know, uh, you get a guy that uh, has a strict diet and gets the right amount of rest, and right maintenance on his body with the same exact talent level as someone that doesn't do that is leaps and bounds for the other guy. So um, for me, I know how important it is and the advantage you get from doing that. Well, Andre, congratulations on the contract extension. We Thanks. look forward to seeing you in a Dolphin uniform for many years for to come. Sure. and can't wait for the 2017 Definitely, season. Definitely, man. Appreciate it. Thank you. All right.